Hello, wonderful people. I want to bring some music into your lives today since we can't come to class. So I want to talk to you about two different things. One of them is, these are water glasses, and you go, well, what is that? They just look like glasses with water in them. But the reason I've got them looking like that is because we're going to talk about something called pitch. Well, pitch is like throwing a ball, right? Well, yeah, that's kind of what pitch is. But in music, look up here, it says pitch, how high or how low a specific sound is to the human ear. And you go, well, what does that mean? Well, let's try this. Let's go, la, 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 la. High, maybe. La, 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 high, low. That is pitch. So let me use another example. If you remember in class, we have xylophones. So what is a xylophone? It's another form of a keyboard, like a piano. So let's listen to this. That's pretty high in it. That's pretty low. See the difference is one's low, one's high. Well then how can we do that with water and glasses? So let's just see what we can do. So as you notice, each one of these has a little bit more water in them than the other glass. And these are the colors of the rainbow. So if you want to put water and color it, you can do that. But it doesn't make a difference with the sound. So let's listen to these five that have no water in them. Could you tell a difference? No. You know why? Because they're all the same. But what happens if we put water like we've done in these and put them in this? Will it change the sound? Well, let's find out. And the reason is coloring it so it look prettier, but it doesn't change the sound at all. So let's see what happens when we add water. Notice that's going to have the most water in it. And way to do this is, and I may have to pour a little bit back out just because I don't want to have too much in one is you can use three to about five different containers of, of glass water. You can do this. Some people use three, some people use five. I'm going to use five today. So, let's see, do we hear a sound? That sounds pretty good. Now then, this is my problem. I've got four colors. So how am I going to fix that? Well, let's work on that. I went to the art department here at our school and I was told how to make orange because, like I said, these are the colors in our rainbow. So I'm going to be asking, let me see, yes, orange is one, yes, if Miss Warren wants to show my expert person over there helping me, you're more than welcome to do that. One and two, so one, two, okay, so let's keep going, though, now we do this one. Like I said, this doesn't change the sound of the pitch of, the, of our glass at all. It just makes it look pretty. And we love pretty, we love, we love colors. So now then, I'm gonna use my spoon and just stir these up a little bit. Ah, the colors of the rainbow, I love it. So now then, let's listen. High, low. Low, high. How about over here? Can you tell a difference? That is pitch. So now then, I'm going to ask you to listen to a song, and if you know what the song is, would you write it in the comments? If you don't, that's okay, but see if you can guess, because one thing about music is about listening. So let's listen to the sound of this song. you figure that out. If not, we'll work on it again when we go back to school. Bye everybody. See you soon.